I'm here today to talk about the FMU plugin that's going to be integrated with SDK 12.4. So the FMU plugin will allow you to ingest FMU slash uh, FMIs into SDK so that you can bring in things like reduced order models from anything that you can create into SDK. So enable to do this, you will open the analysis workbench and go to a vehicle. With on that vehicle, you can create a new component, and this could be a calc scalar component. You will select type of plugin, and then you will see a calc scalar FMU type as the selected plugin. To then alter this, you can go to plugin settings, and on this window, you can see that you can define a FMU path. So for this FMU, I'm using a response surface that was created for wing deflection. Within that FMU, any variable can be either linked to a static value or it can be linked to another component within your analysis workbench. So for this, I have pulled data for the airspeed, the altitude, and the bank rotational velocity of this vehicle. I have linked those as the calc scalar path to these different variables, P10, P12, and P6, which correspond to those um, those values within the FMU. And the output variable is FP3. So P2 and P3 are both output variables in this case, but P3 is going to be our actual wing deflection. Once we hit OK here and OK here, we can then right click on this and say we want to report or graph on this data. And so for this case, I'm going to create a graph of the total wing deformation. And when I hit create graph, you can see the wing deformation change over time. So if I move this out of the way and look at our 3D graphics window here, you will see that the vehicle over time is actually at a relatively static altitude. And that is the case in this plot as well, where we're staying about the same with airspeed varying slightly over time. These values can then be linked to other variables within SDK. They can be used as data displays. They can be used in any other part. Um, and so FMUs really expand your ability for analysis with reduced order models and exp uh, make the analysis much quicker as well. So that is the FMU plugin. Thanks for watching.